filter valve assembly. To assemble, you will need a self-inflating bag, an adapter, a viral filter, a peep valve, and an age-appropriate mask. The assembly process. Attach the appropriate mask to the self-inflating bag. Detach the white cap from the expiratory limb of the device and replace with the adapter and then connect the viral filter and the PEEP valve if using. To facilitate the team's rapid response, we have pre-assembled the setup with different mask sizes and stored them in a clean equipment bag placed in the NICU COVID-19 cart. Providing positive pressure ventilation, the NICU resuscitation team must don proper PPE for institutional guidelines. First, connect the oxygen tubing to the oxygen supply and set the oxygen flow to 10 liters per minute. Use the pre-assembled bag mask filter valve device to provide positive pressure. To ensure proper seal when delivering positive pressure, a two-person bedding technique is recommended. One person ensures mask seal and the other provides positive pressure. Avoid using the T-piece resuscitator to prevent non-disposable device contamination. To assemble the closed suction ventilator system, you will need one appropriately sized Y adapter inline suction catheter, one pediatric vibrating mesh nebulizer adapter and cup, and one standard neonatal ventilator tubing, which includes a bacterial viral filter. Pick the appropriate sized Y adapter and connect the suction tubing to the Y adapter. Connect nebulizer adapter to Y adapter and place vibrating mesh cup to nebulizer adapter. Connect nebulizer adapter to ventilator tubing. This setup will be kept ready by the respiratory therapist before the baby is intubated. For endotracheal intubation, use a video laryngoscope device if possible. This will allow the intubator to maintain a safer distance from the baby. A cuffed endotracheal tube is used for this patient group to maintain a closed system. Once the baby is intubated, inflate the balloon with one milliliter of air to minimize aerosolization of secretions. Then connect the endotracheal tube to the closed suction ventilator system. This is the NICU CV-19 cart. The purpose of this cart is to store essential supplies in the airway management and resuscitation of neonates born to a woman who is suspected or confirmed for COVID-19 infection. This remains outside of the woman's birthing room to avoid contamination. A designated staff member will hand supplies to the staff who will receive the baby in the room. The NICU CV-19 cart consists of the bag mask filter valve device, which was pre-assembled by the respiratory therapist, intubation supplies, miscellaneous items such as the adhesive tape, and monitoring supplies such as electrodes and pulse oximetry probes. We also have the umbilical catheter insertion tray, suctioning supplies, and for emergency chest tube insertion. We also store emergency meds and fluids, as well as flushes. And the last drawer is a personal protective equipment drawer.